Hello again. Can you see me? Okay. Now, you're traveling down the road. Big SUV. You're going 68 miles an hour. Can you picture it? Right? You're on the interstate. You've been driving for hours. It was 30, what was it, 30 meters, meters per second, and it was a 2,000 metric ton truck, mm -hmm. SUV, right? That's 60,000 momentum units, right? Kilogram meters per second. You with me? Mm -hmm. Okay. You see a, a light, a red light in the distance. Shut the door, please. You see a red light in the distance, and you're going to have to come to a stop. And you've been, you've been traveling for quite a while now, and that, that truck feels very powerful to you. And now you're applying the brake very slowly, and you're feeling that power kind of kind of drift off into oblivion, just leaving the truck going into space somewhere. It's bleeding out of the car. You get it? Is that a good visual? Yeah. Well, where's it going? I don't know. Somewhere. Well, what, what does impulse have to do with anything? Well, that bleeding off of the of the momentum, that change in momentum is the impulse. We've said that, right? Impulse is made of force and time. I apply a force for a certain amount of time. That's momentum. Let's say I take 100 seconds to stop. 60,000 divided by 100 is 600. Right there. See that? You see all that? See that? Yeah? 600 Newtons. That's about half my size. I'm about 1,000 Newtons. A little more than half. So, it's, it's a lot, but it's a, we would call it, for me, a half a G. I can live with that. Not bad. And you kind of feel that just before you stop, you feel a little jerk, don't you? Mm -hmm. Yeah. That little, what do you do when just before you stop, what do you do? You take your foot off the brake. Just when you're about to stop and you don't feel that jarring, right? But you can feel that bleeding of the momentum right till you stop, right? Okay. End of part three. Stopping in a routine manner, 600 newtons of force are yielded from the truck and the velocity it was, it was traveling. Okay? Be right back.